Hiya peeps, it's Antar and I'm back with a new PBR battle. Uh, this is a doubles battle against Mr. Neely13, uh, who um, PM'd me through YouTube. Um, yeah, I'm still doing the PBR battles. Um, I am especially looking for people to challenge me for Little Cup and uh, UU doubles. I'm fine if, you know, like this guy, you use one or two OU pokes. But, you know, by and large, try not to, you know, spam OUs if you're trying to challenge me for doubles. Um, but, yeah, so I go ahead and lead off with just my norm uh, my uh, usual combination of um, Lantern and uh, Soul Rock. You know, I know that I... It's a very effective lead combination, uh, as long as I don't overuse it, and as long as I don't just stick to it. So, he leads off with Roserade and um, Gengar, his two OU Pokémon. And, uh, although Roserade is kind of lesser OU, I don't know that it necessarily counts as OU. Um, but anyway, I'm going to go ahead and do some switching here. Um, because, uh, you know, Seafra is in massive, massive jeopardy if I leave it in. Um, I'm gonna, I consider what to do with Lantern, um, and I go ahead and decide I'm going to Hydro Pump his Gengar. Um, so, yeah, I go ahead and call back my, uh, my Soul Rock. And go ahead and send back out um, my uh, Lickitung, Licky Licky, sorry, uh, which is an awesome prediction because he was going for Shadow Ball, so that was basically a free switch. Um, Energy Ball does more than half, but Lantern is a special wall, takes that hit quite well. Uh, Hydro Pump, not enough to uh, even get him down to his Focus Sash, but eh, it does it does a good amount of damage, so I'm I'm pretty happy. I'm going to go ahead and swap uh, Lantern at this point. I'm um, going to go ahead and send in my um, Emily, my Drift Blimp. Uh, that way I can explode once I get Gengar out of the way. Um, Tom, my uh, Licky, Licky gets a Sludge Bomb to the face, does a lot of damage. Energy Ball against Drift Blimp, another excellent prediction on my part uh, since, uh, since she resists it. Um, even though it's resisted, um, Power Whip is going to be enough to finish off that Gengar, and that Gengar is down and out of the way. And so that's probably the Pokémon of his that I was fearing the most, to be honest. So I'm feeling pretty confident about the rest of this. He goes ahead and sends in his Alakazam. Um, Emily goes ahead and uses Icy Wind. I'm actually a little surprised that I outran both of his Pokémon here. Um, but that's really awesome, and now I'm really going to outrun them since they've gotten the speed drops. Um, so I could go for an explosion here um, with my uh, Licky Licky, but I figure, you know, no rush. Unfortunately, he gets a crit, and I'm like, no, no, why? And my, my Licky Licky goes down. That Licky Licky is just not having the best of days. Anyway, his flower goes ahead and spores me, um, or stun spores me, and so Emily is paralyzed. Um, and I am none too happy about that. But I go ahead and send in Aramaki, um, my uh, Mr. Mime, who's going to go ahead and finish off Flower uh, with a nice super effective stab uh, psychic. And that is all good in the hood. Um, and that uh, Roserade is down, and both of his OU Pokemon are now out of the picture, which is awesome. Um, he, he goes ahead and charge beams my Emily, um, does a lot of damage. He doesn't get the uh, special attack boost, though, which is nice for me. I go ahead and um, rest up, uh, cure myself of that um, paralysis, uh, and with the Chesto Berry being consumed, I've now got a speed boost, not that I need it. So now he's got, uh, now uh, Emily goes ahead and Shadow Balls. I'm hoping that it's going to take down his Jomanda, his uh, Alakazam, and indeed it does. So that Alakazam is out of the picture and out of my life and I don't have to worry about it anymore. Um, Aramaki goes ahead and role plays um, Flash Fire from that uh, Rapidash. Um, unfortunately, well, he wasn't going for a Stab Fire attack, he was instead going for a super effective Mega Horn. Thank God it missed. So, wasted turn on my end. Uh, Emily goes ahead and Shadow Balls his Evire. Uh, I'm hoping to take it out. Um, yeah, Aramaki goes ahead and second. Oh, that's a third OU Pokemon. Um, I know, I don't know, I've just never really considered uh, Electivire that big of a threat. I mean, how seriously can you take an electric type? I'm sorry, that's not fair. That's not fair. Ele Electivire is a good Pokemon. Electivire is a good Pokemon. And the electric type is a good type, I guess. Anyway, um, I think that got me down to my Focus Sash. Yeah, uh, Mega Horn hits, super effective and all. 
Um, but, uh, yeah, <laughs> I bet he was kind of pissed that I had a focus ash at that point. So now he's got, um, I think this is a, his last two Pokemon, it is. Um, and so I'm going to go ahead and use Psychic against um, his Drill, I think? I just decided that's the bigger threat. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I've got five Pokemon left. Uh, this bag, this battle is pretty much in the bag. Uh, I, I mean, I don't want to get too go too confident because I have seen, you know, turn turnarounds like this, um, you know, from this point, but still. Um, so anyway, <clears throat> Emily goes ahead and Shadow Balls his, oh uh, yeah, I'm just trying to take out that right carrier. And uh, Shadow Ball does more than half, and he, I get the special defense drop, so now I'm definitely going to be able to kill it with a Psychic. Um, I don't think I've used a special defense drop. Um, I'm pretty sure Aramaki has higher uh, special attack than Drifblim. Um, but yeah, his his drill is down, and he's down to his last Pokemon, his Fire Horse, which goes ahead and uses Strength. Uh, Mr. Neely 13, just so you know, I mean, I don't know whether you want to go through all the trouble of, um, you know, making your Rapidash happy, but it's definitely worth your time to um, do it because then you can use uh, Return instead of Strength. It has more um, base power, does more damage. There's really no reason to use Strength. Um, even a Rock Climb, I think, would be a better move since I think it has a chance of, doing, of flinching. Although I guess it's not 100% uh, accurate. Anyway, um, Mega Horn here again. Uh, it's super effective and I, I does not take out my Seafra, my... Um, uh, my soul rock, although it comes really, really close, but this rock slide is going to be enough to finish the battle, um, and so that's the game. Um, so yeah, I've got like 20 seconds left in this battle, so I don't really know what to say. Oh yeah, so uh, from the life orb, my uh, super goes down, and that is the battle. So what, it was um, three zip? I don't know. Anyway, it was a good battle. Mr. Neely13, uh, I would love to battle you again. Um, comment, rate, subscribe.